Morning, everybody. It is the 22nd of January, about 8.30 in the morning. I'm on my way to work. Very productive morning so far. It is 8.30. Got my 4.15 workout in. 5 a.m. sesh. 6 a.m. Zoom for 30 minutes. 6.30 sesh. And 7.30 Zoom for a half hour to finish off the morning. Got to Zoom later on tonight, 8 o'clock. Um, and now I'm on my way to work. So very productive. I wanted to come in here today and talk about on the daily drive with Jamie being weird. So when one of my clients this morning uh, we spoke about being weird, like the weird things that you do and the weird things that come from your habits that seem weird, weird and quotation marks but in reality it's really the right thing to do and maybe we have a little bit twisted in our society is the weird thing to do is do what everybody else is doing so what I like to try and do is find out with what everybody else is doing and then do the exact opposite uh, let me give you some examples um, a client of mine comes in, I want to do a five o'clock workout before I go to work. All right, let's make that five o'clock sesh happen. We get some feedback from her friends, her family. She's kind of visiting. Um, oh, that's weird. You're going to the gym at five o'clock to work out? That's weird. But is that weird? I don't know. How can you not go to the gym at five o'clock? And how can you not get your workout in? And how can you not prioritize your health? I think that is weird. Oh, it's weird that on vacation you work out. Why would you do something so weird? I don't know. You're kind of going a lot of stress on vacation, don't have a lot of timelines. And typically, if, if you're an early morning riser like how I am, there's really nothing going on at five or six in the morning when you're on vacation because our society has deemed it weird that you work out. So I love the vacations uh, because I do get to work out and you have, for me anyway, a little less hustle and bustle about the day and you're really not on a uh, constricted time frame. So I find it much more productive to be weird on my vacation so I work out um, but some people find it weird once again I find it weird not to because that's when I feel like I get the best workouts is when I'm on vacation or days off or stuff like that so alright you're weird for going to go work out on your day off or weird on vacation now when it comes to habits or things you do as far as I don't know, yoga, um, grounding, reading, podcasts. I don't know, there's a lot of things that are good for you um, that some people find weird. Oh, it's weird that you meditate. Oh, it's weird that you go put your feet in the grass for a certain period of time. A lot of people find that weird. I don't know, once again. I think it's weird if you don't do it because I prioritize my health and fitness before anything else. Now, once again, I'm not knocking anybody. I'm not shaming anybody. If you don't want to put your feet in the grass or you don't want to meditate or you don't, you don't want to wake up at 3.30 in the morning to work out, that's on you. But um, I think to justify it as being weird is really labeling something or labeling how people are. And I respect anybody out there that works out at night, works out at an odd time. I wouldn't say it's weird. I would just say that that person is very, very dedicated. And I think there's some weirdness around food. Um, if you're not drinking or you're doing a dry month, once again, people would deem you weird. Uh, what do you mean you're going to go out? Or what do you mean you're going to be at Thanksgiving dinner? and not drink. And I think the same can be said for food. What do you mean you're not gonna 
indulge or overeat in a bunch of crap on Thanksgiving and Christmas or New Year's, whatever the holiday is. That's weird that you're eating healthy during these holidays. Meanwhile, we live in a society where obesity, obesity mental health, stress, anxiety um, is so obvious and it's so uh, normal for people to be obese or overweight or unhealthy or tired or um, just not happy with themselves. So just my little rant on being weird. Um, I don't know. Be weird. I think it's the best way to be. Everybody have a great weird day.